Well, I went to Georgetown in large measure because it was in, I love politics, and it was D.C. in the uh, uh, epicenter of uh, political thought. And every night you'd have a choice of going and hearing uh the uh, head of state or or a debate between the two leading economists or going to an embassy party, that education right in of itself was great. It was pretty well divided uh, at the time. It's not the uniformity of, of left-wing uh, uh, thought like we think of now. Uh, it was about the half Republican and half Democrat. And Everybody was very political, and I was on the student council with Bill Clinton, for mm-hmm. instance, uh, and uh, my roommate uh, throughout uh, uh, college was a uh, was president of the class the first year, and he was an ardent uh, 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 Robert Kennedy fan. In fact, he spent his. Uh, uh, honeymoon at the Kennedy compound. They let him uh, do that. Uh, and he didn't like Bill Clinton <laughs> uh, and uh, thought he was a phony. Uh, and uh, anyway, we our class uh, went against Clinton for student body president, and it was overwhelming, and that's the reason why he lost. And uh, uh, I have a ton of Bill Clinton stories. Uh, I got along all right with him, but he, I kind of uh, uh, would view uh, his, his remarks with a grain of salt. Uh, later on, his uh, campaign manager in our class, who just loved him, uh, was a guy named Paul Prosperi. And the later time I see Paul Prosperi's list uh, on the on the pardon list for Clinton, uh, he was attorney in uh, Florida, had the first big fundraiser for Clinton for running for president, contributed hundreds of thousands of dollars to Clinton causes, yeah. and had embezzled a million six from his clients. And he got convicted by a federal <laughs> jury and he got his conviction affirmed and then Clinton pardoned him. <laughs> and so uh, it never, the press never picked up on this, yeah. but you know, that's not a case where you got fooled by your uh, Advisors, uh, he he knew this guy really well, and uh, uh, there was no reason to reduce his sentence. Right.